Today I'm delighted to speak to Amy Edmondson, who's a senior professor at the Harvard Business School. Good afternoon, Amy. Good afternoon. Delighted to be here. Amy, the, the world's facing some big problems, whether it be the world economy in the U.S. and Europe, particularly with global warming. It seems like business leaders and business school academics should be able to bring something to the table to help with this. What do you think we can bring to the table? I think we can bring knowledge about management and collaboration, particularly collaboration. But I think that over the years we have learned something about both the challenges and the techniques that help people work together across boundaries. And so by boundaries, those can be, um, those can be across sector, across discipline, even just across, across companies. And so some of the biggest problems that face us are, by definition, complex systemic problems. Healthcare, global warming. None of those problems will be solved by individual experts in siloed, no matter how deep that individual's you know, expertise is. So how do we get people working together effectively in complex initiatives that are really designed to take things up a notch, to do something fundamentally different? I think we know something about that. I and mean, I think we've learned something about that over the years. Now, how do we get a seat at the table where some of these projects are being discussed? Eco-cities, for example, or smart cities, or sustainable urbanization projects. And there are a very, you know, a handful around the planet that range from smaller districts in existing cities to brand new cities, quite a few in China, um, a couple that, that I'm studying, one in northern Portugal, where they're trying to build a city from the ground up that is, you know, low to no carbon, um, uh, requ requires and allows people to sort of walk and interact much more more, more sensibly than than uh, than many um, many of our cities are set up today, and also than than our, our in particular our suburban uh, communities. If you're going to do something like that, it's enormously complex. What we know something about management, we know something about large projects, we know something about interdisciplinary collaboration. We need to be in there helping and sort of beginning to understand and deepen our knowledge by understanding what our knowledge looks like when it's practiced. So you're su suggesting that a business and business schools should um, volunteer to help with these projects or perhaps take some time off and get involved in some way. Is it something where you really need a wholesale commitment or can you do this part-time as a volunteer thing? I think that's a great question and I think the answer is a, is a mix. Right? We could have a portfolio of activities. So one one non-takeoff time answer is start studying some of these very interesting things. They're going on in the world with or without us. Mm. Why not get out there and make that an object of, of academic uh, study, right? So get out there, bring some doctoral students, um, whether that means, you know, get out of the lab or get out of the looking at existing data sets and analyzing this way and that. and figuring out what paper to publish, but actually get out there and study some very tough challenges and some bright people working on those tough challenges. So that's one. Another is, as you suggest, to take some time off and go join a project. Um, maybe, maybe take a leave uh, to do that. Um, or get on a board. Get on a board for one of these uh, smaller startup uh, collaboratives that are, that are uh, undertaking something challenging. And again, I'm, I'm, I'm quite interested in the, in the city space, but I think the same kinds of ambitious initiatives are occurring in, in, in healthcare delivery. How can we really reform the delivery so that it's far less wasteful and far more um, effective in, in, in taking care of patients and so forth? So research, time off, get on a board, do some consulting, uh, lots of possibilities, but let's get out there and look at important issues and do what we can and learn what we can.